Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I am in Greenville, North Carolina at East Carolina University. I was on the way back from the beach and it was right on the way so I decided to stop by because I've never been to ECU. I have a couple of friends that do and I'm really curious to see what campus is like. So I wanted to take you guys along, show you my first impressions and reactions of what this campus looks like um, and hopefully ask uh, some students questions about their experiences here so it helps you or it's just entertaining. So yeah, let's uh, let's get into it and explore. Right now I am like right next to the student union. It looks really nice from the outside. Pretty sure some of it is new. I don't really know though. Behind me I think is their library joiner and it also looks really nice. Like I really like the color of brick which might be a weird thing but going to UNC I see brick a lot. And uh, this one is, is nice to look at. Overall it's a pretty aesthetically pleasing campus so far. It is very empty though. We walked out of the student center. What was your what was your thoughts? Okay, the student center has an amazing interior, and I go to UNC Chapel Hill, so um, I will I think, say that ECU I think they know you by now. Yeah, the ECU's interior is just a lot better and more modern and high quality. There you have it, another union that beats UNC's. Honestly, the the outside of the campus, like everything back there feels pretty similar to UNC and state as in like it's all a lot of brick paths. There's a couple like signature buildings or landmarks or whatever like ECU's version of the old well. I don't even know what it is but it does feel more spacey in a way like you can see everything is crammed together at the top and sort of same thing with state near Tally but like all the buildings here are decently spaced apart. All the paths and stuff are really well maintained and uh Overall, bro, not really much to, to dock this campus on. I haven't really seen its structure or anything yet, but in terms of just the outside itself, I'm impressed. All right, walking into the gym recreation center now. From the outside, it looked better than UNC's. I'm just comparing everything to UNC because that's what I've experienced with. The inside, it looks like two floors. There's a whole open like, like dome. The dome it looks cleaner, it looks bigger. Dude, ECU's campus is like, a lot better than I expected right now. I'm here with, what's your name? My name is Toby Adeniji. Toby right now. And uh, okay, first question. In hindsight, do you regret coming to ECU or do you like it here? Um, I really like it at East Carolina University. It's a, it's a decent school. Um, I really like the class, the classes, the environment. I like the student center especially because you get to play ping pong. <laughs> but yeah, it's a very good environment. It gives you the college experience. Um, even though I'm looking to transfer, I mean, I wouldn't mm -hmm. mind staying here for another two, three years. Okay, so rate your experience here so far from one through ten. Um, I would say a nine. Okay. Damn. Um, you know, it, again, it's a decent school, college experience. I think the only problem is there's just a bunch of lot of like drunk people <laughs> slumped all over the floor. But besides that, it's all it's all good. That okay. I guess you kind of already answered this earlier, but what's your favorite part of like the physical campus? Um. The student center. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We are walking through their game room for the first time. Thoughts? Dude, it's actually insane, dude. This whole student union, um, I always thought Tally was one of the best student unions out there in NT and all those um, colleges, but this manages to beat that. Really? You think yeah. this is better than Tally? I really think this, this is a lot bigger than Tally. Um, Tally's just very like, crowded, and maybe during the school year this is crowded too, but. I, I think the features here tops Tally. I haven't seen enough yet to make it better than Tally, but this it is, is very game, nice. Right? It's already better than UNC's, that's for sure. Toby. All right, we crossed all the dorms and stuff. They look relatively nice from the outside. Well, what did you think of your freshman hey, dorm? Dude, this is a truly this beautiful, beautiful place, day, man. I cannot believe I'm leaving here. Okay, well, that's not what I asked. I asked, uh, what did you think of your freshman year dorm? I was, mine, okay, mine personally was pretty dirty. Okay. But like, normally they're pretty good. Depends on which one you get. All right, yo, I'm here with Spencer right now. All right, first question. In hindsight, do you regret coming to ECU or do you like ECU so far? Uh, no, I, lo I love ECU, man. Everyone here is really friendly and the uh, downtown life is great. Sick, all right. Rate your experience so far from one through 10. Oh, probably like a solid nine. Like nine. A good nine. Two nines so far, interesting. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah. What's your favorite part about ECU's like campus or area, like physical part of it? I mean, I like the bars. The bars are actually a lot of fun. <laughs> we do a lot of shit there. All right, what about least favorite? Least favorite? Mm. Maybe the bars. They're low-key kind of, they're kind of dicks sometimes about shit. <laughs> they're kind of dicks. All right, bars both ways. We are now in downtown Greenville, I believe. It's a nice little place. I guess it's like their version of Franklin Street slash Hillsboro. I think it beats out Hillsboro. 
Probably not Franklin though. I really like the vibe here. It's it's it is uh, a nice vibe. It's an open area. I feel like it's really lively at night. Yeah. There's a lot of things Downtown. to do here. And then last would be Hillsboro. <laughs> this apartment looks like oh you can't see that. But it looks like pretty much the same level as the one we're staying at next year, but it's two hundred dollars cheaper. I'm a little salty, but that's a nice free seat of students, I guess. Back at the student center because my car is right next door. But uh, yeah, okay, this was kind of a fail. There was like nobody on campus. So I wanted to ask at least like four or five people, but I legitimately cost two or three people the entire day. And the third one didn't want to be in the video, so. All right, so obviously that was not like the entire campus. That was pretty quick. And the main reason for that was one, because we only had an hour and a half to spend there, which obviously was not enough to cover the entire thing. So we just wanted to focus on the main points and get a, a decent opinion about those. Two, because this was sort of just meant to be a quick reaction video type thing. I don't want to risk doing like a full 20 minute overview of a college that I don't even go to or haven't really visited at all in the past. And three, because it was a Sunday evening in the summer. So like none of the library or dining hall was open. So, so I couldn't even see those. And also I don't know any freshmen that are living in dorms right now. So I wasn't able to see what that was like, but I did just take the liberty. I watched a bunch of EC videos on YouTube vlogs and just videos by the official accounts and stuff like that about all of those and what I'll say is and obviously this is completely my opinion based on video so it could be very wrong if you're a UC student please weigh in with your thoughts but the dining hall uh, Todd I think is the one I looked at looked kind of above average honestly like the the way it was laid out and there were chefs like right there and the food looked better than some of what we see at UNC and NC State. I'll give the dining halls a benefit of the doubt, but at the end of the day, it'll probably get repetitive, just like any other college's food places. But they did have a decent amount of food options like outside of dining halls in the student center that I saw, which was nice. Uh, the library joiner looked pretty standard. Not much I can say about it, just from the few pictures and videos I saw. Uh, nothing too special. And the dorms, the dorms look kind of small, if I'm being honest. I think the residence hall that I watched the tour of was Clements. It was hall style and the rooms seemed smaller than UNC's and some of NC State's. Like it was like the two beds were right in front of each other and there was only like a little bit of a hallway type thing with the, with the desk and cabinet and stuff on the right. But maybe it is like some other colleges where some dorms are much better than others or if they all look like that then I might have to dock it for a little bit there. But overall from what I saw on campus and online it was better than I thought. Like, I will say that the overall campus itself was smaller than I expected. Like it felt like we walked from the student center to the dorm to outside the library in like 10 minutes, which again could be wrong, but looking at some maps, it did seem that everything was like in one line almost, which may not be a bad thing actually if you're living on campus, that could be really convenient. So take that how you will. And the campus itself looked really good. All the brick paths, the buildings, none of it looked too worn out, like at UNC, that's the case in a lot of the buildings. Um, obviously, I don't know what the insides look like, but from an outside perspective, I'd rate it like a 7.58 out of 10 uh, campus-wise. It's too early to say whether it beats like UNC or State or not, but considering when ECU or for whatever reason you clicked on this video, hopefully that helped you out a bit. I know I couldn't really gauge like the social part of it or any other thing other than the physical campus because obviously no one was there. It wasn't a real like college day. So I'm definitely going to go back next year at some point when everyone's there and ask students some questions and walk around it some more. So stay tuned for that. Hopefully in like September or October, let me know what you want me to ask because yeah, I definitely want to give it a second visit. Those were my thoughts and first impressions of East Carolina University. Let me know. If you go there, if you're planning to go there, what you thought. And thank you all so much for watching. I'm gonna go to Charlotte soon, so keep an eye out for that. And yeah, let me know any questions you have. I'll ask some of my ACU friends if I don't know the answer. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you later. Peace out.